What's up, you What's up, everybody? Family, how you doing? Mr. Justice is back again with another episode. Yeah, this one I want to talk about. This episode is about Go Black to Africa. Go Black to Africa. <laughs> yeah, I want to talk about that, that dude, man. Go Black to Africa. Yeah, I want to talk about him. This dude is a goddamn fucking liar. He's a big liar that uh, people does not can't tell that when he lies. He's a professional liar though. And he exaggerate his whatever. His speech, whenever I mean whenever he make a video, he exaggerate. He said, this guy, you know what, before I go further with the video, please subscribe to Mr. Justice channel and leave your comment. Yeah, speaking of leaving a comment or subscribing to the channel, or speaking of um, leaving a comment, go black to Africa. Yeah, this guy over here, man, he restrict most of his his comment, and now he will say, "Oh, it's a reason why he restrict the co comment." He don't want for people to leave comment because most of the thing that he's saying, he be lying. He's a professional big liar. He tell well lies. He exaggerate. He he manipulate well. He look straight in the camera, and I'm trying to make people seem that whatever he's saying, he telling the truth. But most of the time, he lying. He's a good professional liar. I'm telling you, he's very good. He's just like a this guy, the own the own apology, Necropian. But the own apology in Necropia is like a, this guy. He manipulate well. He he manipulate everything he said, so he can believe. Whatever you saying, but go black to Africa. This guy over here, he, he whatever he looked there in the camera, he looked straight in the camera and tell and miss lies with truth. So when you when he lying, it's very hard for you to tell that he lying. But the own the own apology and Negropian, you can tell that he lying. You can tell that this guy is manipulating everything that he's saying. But you cannot tell when go black to Africa is lying to people that if you exaggerate everything, that he think that everything he's saying is true, that every, everything that comes out of his mouth is true. But guess what? I subscribe to his channel and I've been watching him, I've been analyzing his video. I see how he exaggerate, he lies, tell well lies, he exaggerate and manipulate some of the video, most of the video, and stuff like that. And and then like you know try and make make it seem like a everything every single word that I say oh it's true it's true it's true he trying to make it he make it very professional you know he's a he like a salesman he's like a salesman he's like a very good articulating people who you know he's a you know he's a he can speak very well but when he's speaking you know says let me tell you about sales people sales people. Uh, people who can talk, who can talk you to anything. When it's whenever they're saying things, you will believe in them because uh, they they very good at manipulating, and they are very good by artic um, articulating themselves. You know what I'm saying? They know how to express themselves. They are very good. So everything they're saying is like you will believe it. Just like uh, Pastor Rick from the back bad family. Pastor Rick right there from the bad family. He also is a good salesman who know how to uh, manipulate people, how to say anything to anybody, and you believe it. Now, this go black to Africa over here. I was trying to make a video for, about him for a long time, about all the lies that he been telling. But, you know, I didn't get a chance, whatever. I was so busy, whatever, doing other things and stuff like that. So, but I decided to, you know, to make the video. About all your lies, you keep telling you about, about everything you say is true, you know. Now, this guy, he's another scammer, he's another American scammer who trying to scam people. He didn't never already wrote a book before. All you do, he talk about him, he talk about his military background, and whatever he was in the marine, he was in the military, and stuff like that. So, he used that to you know to tell people, say, Yeah, I'll retire, I'm a retired person from the military. Off on the Mario and whatever and stuff like that, and then he tell 
the black American, what black American want to talk about all the time? He always be talking about shit. Dan Erica, he want to talk about that. He always thought the negative thing about uh, America because that's exactly what he only wants to hear. All the black American audience, that's what they want to hear. But Dan Erica, he called it, he put the E to the, <laughs> he changed the E, whatever. He called it Dan America, whatever, and stuff like that. Because, yeah. So, so he talked. He talked a lot of negative thing, negative thing about, uh, about America and stuff like that. Because yeah, everybody want to hear negative thing about America. Everybody want to hear the, the, the bad thing about America. Yeah, America do have a lot of negative stuff going in the country. They have a, all kind of crazy thing going in the country. So people love that. But go back to Africa. He this came this came guy over here who who got some nerve talking about he want to charge people for four hundred dollars for consultation. Oh my goodness, four hundred dollars for consultation, man! Only a fool will give you a full four uh, hundred dollars for consultation, man! You don't even wrote the book. You know how many books do you wrote? You just making video. All you do, he make video. That's all he make. He ain't no professional. He just a professional liar. But you know whatever. So he professional liar. So people believe what he said. So he not those fool. He trying to ask people to. Gave him four hundred dollars to for consultation. Only a gullible. I'm gonna put in the word there. Only a gullible people will give you four hundred dollars for consultation. You might be a very stupid person for you to give your four hundred dollars to some go back to Africa for some consultation. He's a scammer. And then he exaggerates. Say, oh, I make seventy five thousand dollars every month. Come on, man. You don't make no goddamn seventy five thousand every month. I know if I say that right now, people say, "Oh, I'm whatever." I'm trying to hate. I'm not hating on you, but it's a lie. People who make their money, they quiet about it. They don't say anything. You know, it, let me tell you. You do you know who make make a lot of money on the YouTube channel? This guy over here, Phil Scott from the African Diaspora channel. He making mad money. He been in the game for a long time. He been. He been on a YouTube channel for a long time before all those knuckles start coming in trying to make a YouTube channel. He been he been in the game for a long time. He making mad money. He got how many? He got one point two, I think so two one point two million subscriber or one point three million subscriber now. He know he's a very professional guy. He the one who making all that money, but he shh, shh, he quiet about it. He don't say anything about money. He don't he, he he does not go out there and exaggerate how many money he make. You know, a lot of people who does not make more money or don't have those things, they come all to go on social media or go on thing on YouTube channel exaggerate say, oh, this is how much money I make. I make this money. I make this money. You don't make any more money. Like uh, what am I also might be a little bit, I hate to talk about what am I what am I might be a little bit, he might be making a little bit money too. But he quiet about it. He don't say anything about it. You see, those are the people that will make money. But the one who want the, the people who want to exaggerate with their money is how much they make a monthly or a, a whatever, you know, they, they are liar. The one who want to show up and say, this is what I got, this is what I got, they are all liar. We all know the social media, a lot of people go in from other people's house and take a picture or you go into people's mansion or borrow people's car or bond thing and, and they show up and say, oh, this what, you know, this is my crib or this, this. You know what I'm saying? So go back to Africa. I got more video for him to, to, to you know, to make. I was trying to make a video a long time about this guy or whatever and stuff. So to all you black Americans, I know only the black Americans who are going to give their $400 to this guy for some consultation. You might be a fool because I don't think so any African people are going to give him to give their $400 to this guy. So I see that most black Americans say they all claim they're smart. But how, you gonna, how can you be so gullible and trying to give your you gonna give your four hundred dollars to some go black to Africa for some consultation? Who is just a military? He have a military background. That's all you know. And making beat a professional beat person who professional liar. You wanna give your money to them just like a the bad family who also come with who also is a professional whatever. Uh, Mister Pastor Ray from the bad family who also is a professional salesman will manipulate people and, and, and ask for donation all the time. Another scammer. Go black to Africa. He's another scammer. Another black American scammer. So all you black American, well, that's your business. You want to be, you want to be a, a, a gullible to give your money to go back to Africa 
he whatever, he will take your money. And he don't even shame of it. And he was exaggerating and bragging about saying, oh, I take two weeks off and people call him and say, man, where you at, man? We want you, we want you, we want you back. You know, we want your consultation. Come on. He exaggerated, he exaggerated, he lied. All right? He exaggerated a lot. So I got more video about, you, about, about this guy I'm go back to Africa on the part two. So please subscribe to the channel and like the video. Okay, Mr. this is your boy, Mr. Justice. This is why I'm starting to now drop some gold nuggets in what is really transpiring through the media, through the videos, through people's lives, through what damn America is doing, so that you could be aware that, wow, I didn't even see it that way. So y'all stay tuned. Y'all see that I am out here trying to go ahead and wake people up. That's what life is all about, is bringing that awareness. You know, I thank each and every one of you all who has been reaching out to me for consultations. I am not a surprise that I've had so many people reach out to me for those haters out there who said, Go Black is charging $400 an hour. Yes, and guess what? People have been reaching out and paying it. And they thank me for it because of the fact that the information that I give with contacts Saves you a heck of a lot of trouble when you are traveling international. Look out for my pre-travel international guide. That's right. I have written.